My favorite is that Buick Riviera. When I got arrested by the feds, they took me to jail in 1965 Buick Riviera. Hi, my name's Danny Trejo. Oh, look at that. Look at what good puppies. Hey, you know what, I'm just a dog person. Cats, cats remind me of movie stars. They think they're so entitled. Love dogs. I don't like people that don't like dogs. I did a movie called Machete, and we had asked Robert De Niro to be in it. And when I first ran into him, all I could say to him was, can I get you some coffee, Mr. De Niro? Yeah. <laughs> if I get hurt, I'm risking everybody's job. So when I go on a movie, first thing I tell the director, look Holmes, I won't jump off a curb, okay? Let's see that guy over there, put a mustache on him, it looks just like me. This is Meet the Pets. Come here, boys. Pups. Hey, come on, sit. Come on, sit down. Good boy, you was a half sit. Hey, baby, with your little fat tummy? With your little fat tummy? <laughs> this right here, handsome guy, that's Liam. Six months ago, Liam couldn't walk. His back hips went out. The doctor gave him a shot. He's like a puppy now. That's the Duke, named after John Wayne. And this is John Wesley Harding, named after the meanest cowboy in the West. Once shot a man for snoring too loud. That's Penny Lane. Sergeant Pepper. I think I spoil him with table food. I'll bring him home. Carne asada, I'll wash it real good, get all the spices out of it. They love it. Oh yeah, God. I was sneaking into the Coliseum in 1957. I just, just a kid, I'd go and watch the Rams play. Elroy Crazy Legs Hirsch and Norm Van Brocklin, the Flying Dutchman, they used to call him. When they left, I kind of got away from them. I just worried about point spreads and stuff. Even when the Raiders were here, I wasn't a Raiders fan. They were stepchildren as far as LA was concerned. I think the Rams are pulling everybody together. That is so cool. Let's get behind our team, the Rams. I was angry about the first five Star Wars because there was no Mexicans in it. You know I mean, it was like, wait a minute, you mean we're not going into outer space? So now they're doing all right, you know, and like Robert Rodriguez directed Bobo Fett and it was just a great experience. It's funny, Robert Rodriguez made me a household name with Spy Kids. I've heard, look, mommy, the man from Spy Kids in 30 different languages all over the world. No, it's like the myth. If I get hurt, I'm risking everybody's job. So when I go on a movie, first thing I tell the director, Look, Holmes, I won't jump off a curb, okay? Let's see that guy over there, put a mustache on him, and and looks just like me. I got a stunt guy, Norm Mora. He looks so much like me that my daughter went up and said, Dad, give me some money. <laughs> my most challenging role was the one my son had me do. My son Gilbert, he directed me in a film. I was supposed to cry in it, you know, and, and I was gonna cry like, you know, like John Wayne, you know, like, okay, Pilgrim. We get going, but I lost it. I have never cried like that in my life. I mean, I got the snots. <laughs> and when he finally said, cut, Sasha looks and look, and all the crew was crying. You know, they were all like, <laughs> and my, my son was laughing. Nice acting, Dad. And then I realized what he had done. You know, it's just brilliant. I've never played anybody that vulnerable in a, in a movie. I did a movie called Heat, and Robert De Niro and Al Pacino and Val Kilmer and John Boyd. These were like the big stars, right? And I was so in awe of all of them. I did a movie called Machete, and we had asked Robert De Niro to be in it. And when I first ran into him, he, you know, on the set, he goes, you, hey, number one, uh, you. And we just laughed, you know, because how can you say you're, you know, the lead if Robert De Niro's in the movie, but on the call sheet, I was the lead. So all I could say to him was, can I get you some coffee, Mr. De Niro? Yeah. <laughs> Me, my son, and my daughter, we went to dinner at his hotel and we were eating and I was trying to tell my kids, look, it's Robert De Niro, you guys don't act like kids. You know, just be like, cool. Robert De Niro asked a question about some French director, know your lines, don't bump into the furniture. I know that much about making a movie. And my son knew who he was, to, started talking. The rest of the night was spent with Gilbert, my son, discussing film with Robert De Niro. And I was 
so impressed. It's got Robert De Niro's cell number. I don't even have it. <laughs> I've had dogs all my life. My first recollection of dogs is we had three. My uncle's dog was named Butch. We had Butch, Blackie, and Bazu. From the gate, I was that kid that would say, hey, he followed me home. And <laughs> Have him on a rope, you know? <laughs> I think the good Lord wants us to start living up to all our responsibilities, which one of them is taking care of these guys. They were wolves. We called them in, we domesticated them, we made them our responsibility. Give me that, Duke. Give me that. Give me that. Give me, give me that. Give me that. <laughs> what? Get him, Penny. What was he? I met a producer, his name was Ash Shaw, and he saw that I like good food, I don't eat processed food. He said, Danny, why don't you open a restaurant? And jokingly, I said, Trejo's Tacos, because my mom and I had talked about a restaurant for years. When we did the last movie, he brought me a business plan. I got five restaurants right now. <laughs> Chevy Impala. I gave this one to Mario, uh, my assistant. They're so rare. They only made them one year. It's gorgeous, man. My favorite is that Buick Riviera. When I got arrested by the feds, they took me to jail in 1965 Buick Riviera. This one is the creme de la creme. 1956 Chevy Bel Air. Chopped the top quite a bit. What we've done is like all the Beautiful women that I've worked with are, most of them are here, Alexa Vega, Michelle Rodriguez, Sofia Vergara, Selma Hayek. I love this car. Thank you for watching Meet the Pets. And uh, you really met some great pets today because uh, these are like the love of my life, besides my kids. And uh, my daughter's a favorite. Okay, so. <laughs>